Our topic for today is about product of sum and difference and the square of a trinomial. The product of the sum and difference of the same two terms is equal to the square of the first term minus the square of the second term. For example, a plus b is multiplied by a minus b. This is the indicated sum. This is the indicated difference. The product is the square of the first term minus the square of the second term. To square a trinomial, follow the following steps. Number one, square every term. Number two, Multiply the first term by the second term, then multiply the result by 2. Number 3. Multiply the first term by the third term, then multiply the result by 2. Number 4. Multiply the second term by the third term, then multiply the result by 2. For example, A plus b plus c is squared. Now, this is equal to the square of the first term plus the square of the second term plus the square of the third term. Then, multiply the first term by the second times 2. Multiply the first term by the third term times 2. Multiply the second term by the third term times 2. Let us find the product of the following. Let us solve number one. 5x plus 3 times the 5x minus 3. Observe that the first term here is the same as the first term here. The second term is the same as the second term, only the signs are opposite. In that case, the product is the square of the first term, so 5x times 5x is 25x squared, and then minus the square of the second term, 3 times 3. 9. So the answer is 25x squared minus 9. Number 2. 6c plus 7d times 6c minus 7d. Observe that this is 6c, 6c, 7d, 7d, but the signs are opposite, positive. Negative. In that case, we can square the first term. So 6c times 6c, 36c square, minus the square of the second term. The square of the second term is 49d square. So the answer is 36c square minus 49d square. Number three. 3a three minus 2b plus 5 square. The square of the first term, 3a times 3a is 9a square plus the square of the second term, 4 b square then plus the square of the third term then multiply the first term by the second it's negative 6 a b and then multiply the result by 2 so we have negative 12 a b multiply the first term by the third term 
15a and then multiply their star by 2 so plus 30a and then multiply the second term by the third term negative 10b and then multiply that by 2 so we have negative 20b if you want you can uh, write the constant term at the last part or 9a square plus 4b square minus 12ab plus 30a minus 20b plus 25. This can be done because the addition is commutative. Number 4. 2x plus 4y minus z square. So there are 1, 2, 3. There are 3 terms. We square the first term. 2x times 2x. 4x square. Then plus the square of the second term. 4y times 4y. 16y square. We square this the third term plus c square then multiply the first by the second that is 8xy multiply that result by 2 so plus 16xy multiply the first term by the third negative 2xz multiply that by 2 so we have negative 4 x multiply the second by the third so negative uh, 4 yz then multiply that by 2 so negative 8 